Hey, this is Samir, and this is a very quick tutorial just to show you a cool feature of the Simple Particles object, which is the drawing of particle locations. Um, well, currently, when I generate a Simple Particles object here, and let's just um, increase the birth rate and set it to shot, so 5,000 are emitted per frame, uh, we can see that uh, the particles are emitted from <coughs> everywhere on the surface of my polygon object which is a plane here but it can be any uh, polygon object arbitrary shape um, and I would like the particles not emit from a certain locations here on the surface and I would like to do this manually so really drawing the locations onto the surface and we can do this by going to the simple particles object in the emission source field and change it to brush. We get two new uh, options here. Um, and next thing I need to do is go into the multi tool brush. And that's actually it, right? Uh, I have some options here uh, which allow me to uh, customize how the drawing happens. Um, but let's just draw right away. I think the speed is by default set to 30. Uh, I changed it to 1% before, so you might want to do this. And then you can directly start drawing. The simple particles object has to be selected, by the way, in the uh, uh, object manager, like this. Right. And that's actually, I can now let the particles submit from these particle locations. Pretty cool. And uh, of course, you can just. Um, change some parameters which I can do here a bigger ready for example or let's just erase all that I've drawn before uh, if you're using a tablet you can you also use the pen pressure to uh, control the um, radius I think and the amount of particles generated and uh, well uh, you can also set a higher max samples per uh, Per refresh of the tool actually which is pretty fast so you can see here that a lot more particles are generated if I put this down to one erase again you can see this is much smaller uh, much slower in generation so this is the speed actually how many particles are generated like this boom 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 boom, boom 40 so you can get it dense pretty quickly um, and of course you can also set uh, smaller ready or you can also set a minimum radius like this which I do now so it is generated only in this uh, double circled area outer area um, there are also some other modes like directly on circle so it will only draw them on this circle that you have in the view um, on a line like clicking once and oh no clicking and dragging actually and then I can in the second step start drawing on that line um, and the last thing of course you can also erase by boom 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 and then go to erase and it will then erase the particles with your tool so very very cool and very flexible and also easy to use and oh last thing maybe I should say when I click here once and I do not move my mouse it does not generate any samples only when I move the mouse and if you want it to generate samples anyway you should allow the static brush like this and then you can just click and hold it to generate them at a certain spot here. Swoop. So you can create custom um, locations for the emissions easily by using the multi-tool brush. Very, very handsome. 